Hello guys, today we, I will have a special collaboration with my friend Eric and we're gonna make some collaboration about makeup, we're gonna do a makeup tutorial Hi! <laughs> uh, my name is Eric, um, I'm a drag queen here in Seoul uh, Basically, um, I've been playing around with makeup for a really long time and I've always just loved makeup and drag was just a perfect, you know outlet for me to express all my like artistic and makeup mm -hmm. like fantasy so how how you start like how do you start how was how was your beginning how how was everything for you um i basically started uh my interest in drag when i was watching rupaul's drag race like throughout high school and i loved it it was so fun you know everyone is gorgeous and i just got into it so much and then i moved to shanghai for college and then, like, they would have these like drag competitions. Oh, cool! At the gay club. Amazing. Yeah. Oh. So I was like, we can try it. And then I went. <laughs> I looked busted, but it was still really fun. And uh, that's how it started. Oh, it was good. So what? What does like? What is drag? What does drag mean for you? Personally, it is uh, something that really empowers me, and it has been, you know, it's been something that's led, allowed me to do a lot of the things mm -hmm. I thought I never could in my life. Like, for example, like. You know, fully coming out to my parents as yeah. not only a gay person but also a drag queen. It was really hard, but at the same time, like my drag, I feel really strengthened me. And if it wasn't for that, I probably wouldn't be who I am today. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, and I see you, girl, and you are every single time you are killing the stage. You so You're amazing. Much. So now we're gonna let my friend Eric to get into Erica Balenciaga. Yes. So let's. Wait a minute and let's see how she does her makeup, okay? Yeah, yeah. She's <laughs> Half done. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So she's about to wait for your face to. I'm baking it, cooking it, setting it. Exactly. So I'm gonna start. She's gonna start mine. Let's see how it goes. All right. So I'm gonna first put on some primer on your face. Oh. Mm -hmm. This is gonna help, like, keep all that beautiful makeup on, you know, the whole night. Whether you're Dancing, singing, playing. 
playing, digging down, whatever you're doing, <laughs> it's gonna <laughs> stick on that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, you know, Lila has really good skin, so this shit is absorbing real good. Honey. So tell me. I'm gonna have a 20 this spring. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I kind of know. <laughs> so now I'm gonna get some alcohol pads, and we're gonna make her eyebrows like Ooh. more clean. Ooh. And so I'm just gonna put like a little bit so that we can clear up any dirt or grime or excess that she might have had. But she doesn't because she's clean. <laughs> I'm a clean queen. She's a clean girl. She's a clean queen. Now we're going to use the old trick, the classic Elmer's glue stick. Um, it's like purple. And we're going to get that all over her brows Ooh. and cover them up. Then, we're gonna use um, this spoolie thing to really flatten them down. All right, and we're gonna oh. let this dry a little bit, um, but we're gonna put some powder on. Dry. I use like a special uh, mix of powders that I will not reveal, um, but powdering your face is so important if you want your makeup to last all night long, especially if you're a queen who's performing with high energy, then girl, powdering is your best friend. Alright, so we're gonna just go through that a couple more times, right? All right, and we're just gonna let that sit for like two minutes. Okay, so now that we're done with that, I'm gonna go over her eyebrows. Usually I would do white, but so I'm gonna just try this color, um, the Krylon TV paint stick. All right, so now that that's done, I'm gonna get some sponge action Ooh. and just sponge it. One more layer of foundation, because why not? And then let's go straight to the eyeshadow. I'm so excited. So I'm gonna go in again with my blending brush, and we're gonna go into this really, really, really pink color. It's like bright ass pink. And then I'm gonna get that all over her um, crease area. How often do you do drag and you make all this transformation? Um, I do it like every weekend mostly. Um, I try to kind of keep doing it because it keeps me really busy and really like inspired to try out a lot of different looks and stuff so yeah I would feel like I try to do it every weekend. I'm gonna just quickly swirl it around this sponge it's a trick I learned and then the color just goes off it's really nice for cleaning your brushes. So we're gonna get this deeper shade and kind of blend it. There's a lot of different drag styles. If I had to kind of define mine, it would be very like, a lot of people say fishy, but I kind of like using like my natural features to create a look. Like, I mean, it's, you know, I've tried doing like things that change my face a lot. Yeah, that's true. But I think my style I, that I'm most like comfortable with is just like really going in with your Working with your face with yeah. like, everything you have for mm -hmm. I'm gonna set that with 
a little bit of Jeffree Star. Ooh. Ice cold, my forever highlighter. This shit literally just shines. You can see your highlight from the moon. So now that the eyeshadow is laid, I'm gonna get some eyeliner and put it on her. So what we're gonna do now is we're going to um, lay down the rest of the foundation. So I think I can use this or we can also even, I'm gonna put some white on the highlight. Now we're gonna go in um, with this Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit that I adore and I've been using this one for a long ass time as you can tell. And I'm just gonna go in you know, with some shades and put it on the contours of the face. Right here, right here, literally nothing on the nose, but I will do it anyways. Now that we have this set up here, um, we're going to just powder it. We're going to set it. Set it with all this I'm baking powder. Me. Yeah, so we're going to bake this honey. All right, so now she's going to bake for around three, five minutes. So now I'm gonna dust off all of this excess powder because we don't want her looking like a pancake no more. Just make it go all the way. Bye powder. Um, I'm gonna get my contour stick and we're gonna just dip it into uh, these contour shades that are shadows actually. And we're just gonna go around the areas that we really make them pop. And so, Ooh. these are all of the blush palettes. Yeah. I'm gonna mix these two because they are the most pigmented ones. And just put it right here on the... And we're gonna get some more of that Jeffree Star highlighter and put it right here, honey, where literally the light and the sun just, oh my god. I'm shook. Stunning. Stun. <laughs> she feels stun. Okay, we're gonna put on these uh, lashes first because we have to make sure that the longer lashes stay on. My eyes are completely done. Let's see what's next, baby. All right, so your eyes are done. She is looking cute or whatever. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I can. So we're gonna I have to go. Oh, yeah. Girl, feel your oats. <laughs> I think we're gonna now go into the lips because that's oh, what yeah. completes the look. Yeah.
take off all the makeup. How is it? It feels. It's gonna be my first time. I take all this thing out of me. It takes yeah. forever. That's for really. Sure. That, yeah, that's for sure. Yes. It takes forever. Um, and also, like sometimes, like I wake up the next morning and there's still shit all over my face, <laughs> and I can't. Um. So, yeah. All right. So now that you are pretty much set, I'm gonna use this Urban Decay finishing spray, and I'm gonna finish her face. Yes. Let that just lock in. Ooh. Hi. Hello. Hi, this is my friend Erica. Actually, my mom. <laughs> my drag mom. <laughs> it was so fun doing this. Thank you so yeah, much. Yeah, I and know. You gotta introduce your drag name too. Oh, my new name is Enya Cal Balenciaga. Yes. So tell us where we can follow you. We can on social media. You can follow me on Instagram at Erica Balenciaga96. You can check it out here. <laughs> And mine oh, is Miss Monster, so I will put it there so you can, you guys, you can follow us. It was such a great time having, like, having this experience for the first time. And you're such a good makeup artist. Thank you yeah. so much. I had so much fun. Yeah. So, see you guys later. Bye! Bye!